talk about the decision uh, and what's transpired over the past 48 hours? Well, it's been a really difficult decision for me and my family. Uh, I was contacted early in the week by Tulane, um, and uh, you know they were interested in talking with me. I went ahead and visited with them, and uh, you know, uh, you know, I, I just think in this point in my career and in my life, it's a heck of an opportunity. I just want to really thank everybody with Georgia, Georgia Southern. I want to thank you, Frank, and and uh, you know everybody at your station, and and just uh, uh, you know Eagle Nation for all the great support they've given us. I, I'm, I'm proud of what we've accomplished. Uh, I think two years ago when we came here, uh, nobody imagined that we were going to do the things we did at the Division One level, and, and uh, you know that's a credit to my coaching staff, uh, my support staff. Uh, the players, obviously, more so than anybody else, and then also the great fan support that we've had. And, and it's been a tremendous two-year ride. Uh, best record in the conference over two years, Division One, going from one double-A to Division One, and then uh, winning the conference outright, and then also qualifying for the first bowl game in Georgia Southern history. So I'm really proud of what we've accomplished, and I'm, I'm just thankful to everybody who has helped me along the way and helped us get to where we're at. And that's got to be the hardest part is saying goodbye to the friendships that were made here and, and some of the kids who you guys have brought in, but it's part of the business and, and, and that is life of, of college football and, and coaching in this and having this profession. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a tough profession. It really is. I had somebody tell me the other day it's a, it's a great profession but a terrible business. And uh, they, they might be right in some regards. Uh, I look around at some of the, some guys I know well who have done a tremendous job and are out of a job now. And, and uh, so it's uh, it's a it's a tough business, you know, and, and uh, it really is. I, I've just been really blessed uh, to be here at Georgia Southern and some other fine institutions, and, and uh, obviously I, I'm very excited about this opportunity. Uh, but also, a part of me is uh, very sad for for leaving Statesboro and and Georgia Southern. Talk about the opportunity at Tulane. Uh, 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 maybe a, a lot of people look at it better conference, new facilities, and of course, financially. Uh, talk about the decision. Well, all those things that you just said. Uh, uh, you know, a part of me, I've just kind of always done this rebuild deal. You know, I've done it a lot of places, and uh, though people might not have thought that at Georgia Southern, to a certain extent with four and four in conference play and going moving up, it, it, was, it was a challenge uh, uh, with moving up uh, a level of, of competition. So. It's uh, it's going to be very challenging. You know, they they have, they obviously don't have the storied history and traditions that, that Georgia Southern has. We won six national championships and all those kind of things. But uh, uh, you know, we're going to work hard and roll our sleeves up and and uh, you know uh, uh, work extremely hard and and getting it done there as well. Final question, what kind of legacy do you think you leave here in Statesboro? It was brief for two years, but you guys got so much accomplished, and, and I know you got to be proud of the work that was done here. Very proud of it, uh, without question. And, uh, you know, uh, uh, that's for other people to decide. But I'm, I, you know, I'm just uh, thankful of this opportunity that Dr. Keel and uh, Tom Kleinlein uh, gave me a couple years ago and the search committee and, and everybody involved in in uh, Georgia Southern University and the football program, and just the university. It's a special place. Every, I'm sure everybody uh, knows that, and, and uh, with special people, which is uh, uh, the toughest thing about leaving here.